The bell at Petal Elementary School rang through the halls. The flower friends jumped up from their desks. It was time to go to the art room, one of their favorite places in the school. Zinni was especially excited because she loved to draw and paint. She was already thinking about the new picture she wanted to make. It would show all of the flower friends having a party in the daisy flower garden. She burst into the art room ahead of everybody else and she was the first one there. I'm in luck, she said, grabbing several bottles of paint. She put them in front of an easel with a blank piece of paper on it. I can get all the colors I want to make my painting. The other flower friends came into the room. Oh, look, there are new coloring books, Clover said. She picked up three of them. Gloria and Jerry each took two more. They put the coloring books on a table by the window and sat down. Rosie rushed over to the cupboard that held the crayons and markers. She grabbed a bin and took it to a table by the door. Vi and Lupe did the same thing. Then the two groups of flower friends stared at each other. Wait a second, Glover said. We need crayons and markers to color in the coloring books. Well, we need coloring books to use our crayons, Rosie said. Zinni looked at her friends. None of them were happy. Then she saw a goldfinch standing shyly by another easel that had a painting of a tree on it. The painting wasn't quite finished. Only half of the leaves had been painted. Zinni glanced down at the bottles of paint in front of her. Oh, I'm sorry, she said to the goldfinch. I was so excited about my picture that I took all the paint. That wasn't very considerate of me. We should share. Um, what colors do you want? Thank you, the goldfish said with a big smile. I'd like the bottle of green paint to add more leaves to my tree, please. Clover and Rosie watched as the goldfinch began painting happily. Zinni's right, Clover said. Sharing is a way of caring for your friends. She turned to Rosie. Rosie, why don't you take one of these coloring books? Jerry and Gloria smiled as they held out their stacks of coloring books to Vi and Lupe. Yes, pick the one you'd like, Jerry said. Gloria nodded. After all, she said, we can only color one picture at a time. Thanks, Clover, Rosie said. Do you want to use some of the crayons and markers? When you're done, we can trade. That's a great idea, Vi and Lupe said together. All the flower friends sat down to color. It's so much nicer when we can all paint and color together, Zinni said. And when we're done, we'll have a beautiful art gallery to show our friends and families. The end. <laughs>